Coming to you live from Slayman Main Stadium in Tara Bay, home of the Mutineers. This stadium is filled to capacity, and this crowd is feeling it. Yeah, especially that guy with that sword in his back. Well, what do you expect? It was free Saber Day for the Mutineers. First thousand fans get a rusty dull sword. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for MFL action. The Malice Hellboys take on the Terror Bay Mutineers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hello once again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Huh? Hey, how'd your checkup go? Well, good news, bad news. Doc says I passed my physical. Oh, that's good. But I flunked my mental. Not too good. Well, I, it's 50-50. Better odds than I get in Vegas. Get a point. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. First and ten. Man, this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. First and ten. A great throw and a great catch, but sadly to the wrong team. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. <laughs> First and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. Pass and catch for three. The receiver needs to break some tackles. Second down and seven. Hot. Hot. And he breaks. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. Oh, oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. First and ten. Second down in a very lot. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes off and he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. And this guy couldn't hit the side.
inside of a fallout shelter. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he's running like a moose right now. Well, good luck. Oh, what a brutal hit! Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I had to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more! And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Punt should move him back nicely. And that's how you shark the monkey. Thunderclap. And it's first and ten. QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. <laughs> and it's first and ten. That's a TR pass play, and that's not going to get it done. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the rep didn't see it, at least the mortician did. Yeah. He's coming out in the field now. I won't even get out of you. Yeah, 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 yeah. First down and six. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. And the ref just called a bullshit penalty. And this is a first and long. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. And the ref runs out of bounds and manages to survive somehow. Yeah, at least for another 40 seconds. <laughs> First down and forever. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? Ah, another interception. He should get this guy. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Kill him yet. He's wearing a new mink coat for God's sake. He's seven layers of smarmy grin. Second down and long defense.
Sainz says enough of this BS and jumps off Sainz to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> Second down and six. I know I said another hit a man when he's down. He's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. Hey, oh, and that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. That's a pass and catch for no game. Then how is it a pass? Second down and ten. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Whoa, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. And it's first and ten. Nicely done, picks up three on that pass play. Ula. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. First and ten. And there's an eight yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Second down and two. Pressure right there, folks. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. Oh, I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they had raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Oh, that was a snooze fest.
First down the seven. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Second down and seven. today. <laughs> he was right. Kapow! And that'll bring up third down and seven. Either way, they're going for two. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. Yeah, it got blown to shit. Speaking of blow, where's my little pile? The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. I love the murder ball daddy trick. And the quarterback drills one in for the first. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Ben? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, oh, oh. That gets me every time. Like a jack in the box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is going to blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. First down and one. for one when he could go for two. It's always been my philosophy. But Bricks can't even get one. Well, you're talking about points. They're looking for burn after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. What a hit that was. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> and he fumbles it, Briggs. That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one. First and ten. And the 
And that's another turnover for the defense. Hey, the piece of licorice wants to get a shot like that. It wasn't licorice, you idiot. It was the freight cord of a leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord that looked like licorice. The point is... Ah, I forgot my point. And it's first and ten. Second and eight to go. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And that puts six points on the board! The defense couldn't do anything to stop a thrown out good, man! You mean aside from driving the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. Come on! And the quarterback unleashes a second. They pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. And that'll bring up second and one. Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. didn't see it. At least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. First down and nine.
boo baby. I'm the greatest. No, you didn't say I'm too fast. <laughs> Second down and ten. Oh, the defender almost picked up the ball on that one. Third down and ten. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. Second down and ten. whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? And it's first and ten. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. They stop the clock with their first timeout, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. <laughs> You gotta love a player who goes down fighting. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Close, but no cigar. Yeah, you think you can go toe to toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Oh, great play! He is on that receiver like glue. The ref that just called that penalty, he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That sounds like a good job. He's right at home here, taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swiping money from the bathroom attendant. Hey, who don't do that? For a kick this far, you just got to kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim. It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just get the points and let's move on. <laughs> when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Yeah, I'm still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. The burn 
Trevor Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn return of grin? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He's probably grabbed his pants. They're going for two points. the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the halftime show. It's still anyone's game here as we start the third quarter. I missed it, Grim. I was out in the concourse grabbing some food, and there was this mutant leopard in line, and he left in an angry hop. Why did he leave, Bricks? You know, people kept dipping their chips in him. Oh, we get out of it. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Ah, oh, it just got eaten. It reminds me that that song by the mutant men at work. Got it swallowed from a worm down on that. Uh, pretty sure those weren't the lyrics there, uh, Bricks. Pretty sure they weren't, Grim. Second down and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and ten. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? And it's first and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have been boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna Grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. First down and inch it. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. <laughs> First and ten. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. Big quarterback can be hurting or dead. Second down in a very lot. Third down, and the punter is warming up. 
Chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. From prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> the kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. First down and forever. see a lot of carnage today folks these teams have bad blood between them apparently they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck raccoon rabies blood is my thought always a player's favorite second down and ain't gonna happen partner the offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one that is still edible though just gotta scrape off the charred parts Third down and, well, good luck. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. And he oh, with the Brandler. And it's first and ten. Consider running the ball more. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> and then, my friends, is why the world hates kickers. I kind of feel sorry for them. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't wrong in my brain. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crushed. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with, uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. He's at the 10, and he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run! Yeah, man, I was keeping on, you know, now. And here comes the extra point attempt. Could have made that kick. Isn't your sister in a wheelchair? I know, right? Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. 
Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. First and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot of it. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaur. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. First and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. <laughs> I like this. They're going for two. Teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. First down in a mile. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And 
It's first and ten. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. And he's up. No doubt about it. That guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message for that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message, because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Grim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the funeral expenses, that is. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. Turn here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for you. You know what? Never mind. <laughs> and it's first and ten. He had it for a second there. Second down and ten. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and weep tonight. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. I don't even know how much. Quarter three comes to an end, but this game is far from over and will be decided in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First down and less than a Defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The home.
home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Oh, oh man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, man. And it's first and ten. way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing and it's first and ten and the quarterback throws a murder ball which will slice his way through any uh, come on man you gotta catch that i don't catch anything Grim. i'm retired <laughs> Second down and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. First and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Uh, normally, I don't advocate for changing the station, but for the sake of your eternal soul, I'd understand if you want to cut away during this ritualistic dance. Uh, Grim? The, uh, the crowd started chanting. Why, uh, yes, uh, <laughs> yes, they did. We're, we're going to go ahead and lock the announcer's booth until he's done dancing. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. That's them seven yards. Oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get rid of them again? You stick your head in a plastic bag, say the alphabet backwards while you set yourself on fire and jump out the window. It ought to stop them. Third down and long. He could go all the way. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a run. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. First and ten. We know this quarterback likes to play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. Yeah, that's a lot of balls, Grim. Second down and long. Assuming he was aiming for the ground. Third down and the punter is warming up. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Here comes the defense. 
First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. The defense is running low on linebackers. They have only two left. You need to play smart from here on out. That's defense, Grim. You're asking too much of them. And it's first and ten. More points, so they're going for two. And it plows forward for the two point conversion. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one time thing. And it's first and ten. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. He could go all the way. He's at the 20. The 10. Touchdown. And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done. I can't run like that unless it's coupon night at Taco Hell. He has been a football though to me. On a kind of not clenching his cheeks though. Yeah, yeah. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The 20. Oh, man, he really wants it. He's at the 10. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Receiver. They'll be playing shorthanded for the rest of the game. Uh, and if they lose him, will they have to forfeit? Oh, talk about pressure. I'm going to have to take the value before this one ends. Hey, y'all been out on me. And they line up for the extra point. And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. The 30. He's at the 20, the 10, and he held on to that one for a first down. I know I said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there.
first and two. lost another line basher on that play and only two remain on their roster their defense is getting very close to forfeiting this game second down and two with multiple interceptions. The QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, oh, that's got to hurt. Snatched in midair by the worm. They say that the early one gets the Newton, and he got all of him. Oh, look, he's splitting the plates out. And it's first and ten. Second down and ten. Ah, another interception. Did you get this? Oh, did he take a punishing hit? You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? Yeah, the waitress at the pool hooters chicken wings last night? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and then, then the police horse is out front in the stadium earlier. That was just a joke slap, but the horse took it seriously. Not surprised. He's at the 30, the 20, he's at the 10, and the defense is on his heels. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? And like Bricks is by. to think I'm cool. <laughs> well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. You have got to be kidding me. My sister could have made that kick. The Terra Bay Muneers lose at home today. It was shot by the opposition. What a cannonball. They fought tooth and nail, but in the end, lose by three. It's a hell of a thing losing at home. They took away all they've got and all they're ever going to have. Yeah, well, they played like shit. Fuck them. Fuck them indeed, Junior. Let's go down the field and see what that meathead has to say about his MVP award. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every up.